What's up guys, it's Stacy and Charles, so today we're going to be reacting to the 2022 Billboard Year End, which just got released today. Um, this video is from DJ Sid Matchup, so I watched some of his videos, and oh god, we got a spoiler already. Alright, here we go, why not? And by the way, I'm muting this because copyright, you know, we don't want to get copyright claimed. Alright, and then I'll be putting, I'll be, let's go, 100 to 91, I'll say what the best song is. Circles Around the Town by Marin Morris. Okay, bro. I have not heard of this song. It's spent 25 weeks. One Mississippi by a Kane Brown. Okay. Yeah, I've not heard about this either. Dude, these are songs that I don't know, unfortunately. Ah, yeah. Unholy. Somehow, it peaked number one for a week. Yeah. Until, like, all the Taylor Swift sh happened. Yeah. To the moon, I've heard that before. Okay, I've definitely not heard flower shops though. All right. Looking like Unholy is the best right now. And yeah, I have not heard of the song either. Alright. She's all I want to be. Okay, okay. Yeah. Tay McCree is pretty unrated, not gonna lie. Uh. <laughs> Okay, I wonder where we'll put that. Um, yeah, I have not heard of this either. Oh, God. I'm shivering. It's cold out here, bro. Okay, I have not heard of that either. Okay. Dude, I'm flipping shivering. Okay, alright. Look like we got a number one. It's obviously gonna be unholy. Alright. I mean, Sam Smith and Kim Fretch just did a really good job on creating that. It's really bop, you know. Definitely the best song for from 100 to 91, All right? Kiss Me More. Oh, God. I've heard of this. Yeah, I've heard of this a lot. Okay, now, we're not counting Christmas songs. Come on, now. Why, why do we have Christmas songs now? Why do we got like, Christmas songs? Come on, now. Okay, I've not heard of this. Let's skip. Yeah, okay, Bad Bunny. All right, yeah. I don't listen to his songs, unfortunately. <laughs> but, like... Yeah. Oh god, we got another Christmas song. Skip that. I'm trying to make this video not so long here. It's looking like Kiss Me More isn't the best from here. Yeah, I've not heard of this. Let's just skip that. Yeah, I've not heard of this either, so let's skip that as well. Take My Name, Parmalee. Okay. It's been 20 weeks. Hold up. Let me go to the current list right now. See if it re-entered or something. It's been how many weeks, though? Yeah, Antihero is still number one. Yeah, we should have got another week because, you know. Um. We could have got another one. Maybe Antihero would have entered, like, the top 100 and I would have been the best. Look, I might be confused. Oh, yeah, no re entries. Yeah. Dude, when did, when did it ever enter, though? It started to get popular again, though. Oh, yeah, we don't know this one. Oh, alright, we're at the end. It's definitely Kiss Me More, number one. And Take My Name, I, it's starting to get annoying because it's playing too much, but yeah, I'm starting to like it more. But that's number two on this list, and the rest I'm not hearing. So Kiss Me More, number one. And we have another Christmas song. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay, we don't know this one. Dude, I'm so sorry for disrespecting you. And yeah, we have not heard this one either. Oh, we got another Bad Bunny song. What the heck? All too well. I have not really heard of this, unfortunately. So sorry, Swifties, if you're watching these, but, like, gosh. I have not heard of this. Fingers crossed. Okay. Right. Yeah. I've heard of this before, 100%. And, yeah. I looked like we got more two songs in here. Um, I don't know which one's better. Oh, my God. Yeah, I've heard that. Okay. We're skipping a lot. Okay, we're at the end. Dude, we're progressing fast. Okay, looks like the best one has to be Fingers Crossed, unfortunately. <laughs> but this list is pretty terrible, not gonna lie. But we're gonna have Fingers Crossed the best from 80 to 71. 70, yeah, I've not heard of this, unfortunately. Okay, another bad money song. Dude, I'm not gonna pronounce these, okay? It's Spanish. Get into it, yeah, okay. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I was obsessed with Doja Cat for like a, f for like a few months, not gonna lie. And that might be the best one from this list. Oh my god, I'm still I'm shivering. 
All right. Yeah, yeah. Bum bum. Definitely taking ahead right now. Oh no. <laughs> 67 in 2020, 78 in 2021, 65 right now. Right now on the billboard right now it's like 5. It's number 5. Okay, I've not heard of this. We're not counting Christmas songs, all right? That's the song I've spoiled, unfortunately. Oh God! Oh God! No! 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 This is gonna make me hard to choose. Okay, I have not heard of the song either. Okay, we're going get into it, y'all, or bum bum or sweetest pie. God. Okay, you know what? We're going with. Oh my God! Isn't it's gonna be bum bum? And then Sweetest Pie is in second. And then Get Into It Young is um, third. Alright, 60 to 51. Knife talk. Dude. Drake made a whole album with 21 Savage, and it really it took over for like a few weeks. For a week. <clears throat> Dude, I'm still shivering. Send him up. Okay. Guys, is there any songs that I know in here? Come on now. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, please, please. Super Freaky Girl. Okay, I've only heard this a few times. And it's looking like the best one, unfortunately. Oh. Yeah, okay. Looks like we got a new one. Lo love non one TT. Okay. Is this an Encanto song? It looks like one. Okay. Yeah, we got a new one. Dude, Glimpse of the music video has a lot of violence, not gonna lie. It looks like it had a lot of violence in there. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is too hard now. This is too hard now. It's too hard. Love no TT. Super Freaky Girl or Boyfriend. We're gonna have to go for Boyfriend. Because I haven't heard Super Freaky Girl that much. And if I heard it a lot, it would have been number one. But it's number three. And then I have. Yeah, that in second. Okay, so yeah. Oh no, I've not heard of this song, but I've like, no, I haven't heard it, but I like, I've seen it like in radios. Alright, 50 to 41. I have not heard of By Dirt, or I mean, Push and P, I don't know. Maybe? Vegas. Oh yeah, <laughs> another Doja Cat song on the list. Let's go. You all oh my. Looks like it's Battle of the Doja Cat songs in this list here, 50 to 41. Moscow Moore. In a minute. Okay. I have not heard of this either. Levin. Oh, God. We don't know who's taking this yet. Oh, God. Oh, my God. We have four songs to choose from here. I'm going to have to go with... We're going with Vegas and then Levitating. And then... Uh, what were the other songs? Oh, crap. We got another one in here. You're right, you're right, and then, yeah. Alright, save your tears for kicking off 40 to 31. Something in the orange. I have not heard of this. Break my soul. Oh, God. No, 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 no. We got three songs now. We got three to choose from. Nope, we have not heard of this, unfortunately. Fancy like, we have four, but that is definitely not going to win. Because it's cringing me. It's a little annoying. Jimmy Cook's. Alright, we got M by holding them little bug here. Four. That's four now. Oh yeah, I loved this song for like a few months, bro. Dude, the way M levitates herself, like what does she do to do that? Wait, like is she kick she's kicking a wall. And she's like, what what do they do to do this? Cause I know Oh, shoot. Oh crap. We got five songs now. Five. Okay. Well I'm gonna have to go for numb little bug for the best from forty to thirty one. Good for you for, for number two. And, uh, God. Fancy, like, 100% last. No, never mind, never mind, never mind. We have I Ain't Worried, and then Good For You, and then Break My Soul. Yeah. Fancy, like, Dead Last in this. Man. Like, nobody likes that song. Alright. Oh, God. No, we have good songs that I've heard before. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. You know what? You know what? You know what? Okay. This run's already over. Sun New 41. That's my favorite song as of now, bro. Come on now. Come on now. Peak number four. Still in the billboard. In fact, what is it, like 20-something right now? But yeah, this is obviously the best one from here. No cap. I mean, no cap from me. Oh, yikes. That is number two. 
That was gonna be number two, Bad Habit. I didn't like this before, but like, as I heard it more, I liked it more. You gotta say, you just listen to the songs more and then you'll like them more, you know? We made this video at 9.01, it's been 11 minutes. You approve. Oh, no. This is number three. This is number three. Okay. So, 100% number one. We used that song for the JC versus Cedric finals. Um, was number two again? It was Bad Habit. And then, you know what? You know what? You know what? This is number three. I like it was four. Come on. There's a bunch of good songs from 30 to 21. Come on now. Dude. Oh. Okay. That's going to be five, I think, if we have a fifth song. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh my god. Okay, that is 100% five. And we don't talk about Bruno. We'll be six, unfortunately. I haven't seen Encanto. Oh, this song. Alright, and. No, there's a lot. Okay, you know what? Woman will go at four. Woman will go at four. Alright. Woman was my favorite song for a bit, but now it's Sunroof. 100% taking number one. Alright. No, no, nah. We're taking woman at four, all right? All right, we're going from 20 to 11 now, okay? But yeah. Then I'm gonna rank the top 10 from this year, because why not? Wasted on you. Somehow I know this song more than you proof for some reason. Need to know. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Oh god, this is tough now. This is starting to get more tougher. That's two now. A, B, yeah. Dude, I watched one of the, her videos. Bro, oh my god, we have four songs now? What is it? Lil Nas X, Gale, um, who else? Doja Cat and Morgan Wallen in here. Crap. Oh, no, 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 no. We have five songs now. Five songs to choose for number one. Now we have six. We have six now. We have six now. I don't remember seeing that in the music video. I watched it. Oh, no, no, no. We have seven. We have seven music videos from here to choose from. See what's the best from 20 to 11. About, oh, about damn time. That might be the best one. Who knows? The move that Lizzo's doing, though, it's funny. Okay, we have not heard of this. So, eight songs to choose from from here. Okay, we have Wasted On You, Need To Know, ABCDEFU, Industry Baby Enemy, That's What I Want, Bad Habits, and About Damn Time. Yeah, About Damn Time has to take that number one. And then number two, that's going to be Industry Baby. That's What I Want for three. Bad, no, Bad Habits is three. That's What I Want is four. Enemy is five. ABCDEFU is six. And then... Wasted on you will be seven and need to know will be eight for this one. Oh god, there's a lot of good songs. Eleven. Alright, we're going from ten to one. Cold Heart. Elton John and Dua Lipa right there. Ten to one. That's one to choose from. Mm. Number nine. Okay, we have not heard of this song actually. <laughs> Crass. Ghost. Okay. Alright, yeah. Heard the song a lot as well on the radio, you know. Radio driven ones. Okay, what else? Big energy. We have three now. We have three now. And big energy peaked at three. You know, some of these songs appeared on the 2021 year end, but they he didn't put put it there. First class, that's four. That's four now. <laughs> Number oh shivers, shivers. Shivers is getting milked on the radio, and it's been years. It's been a year for like what? So I want them to get rid of it um, for some reason. Six. Alright, we have six songs now. And I think we'll know the last three, I think. So, Easy On Me, top three. Let's see. Kid Leroy and Justin Bieber with Stay. That was 12 in last year. It's three this year. Only seven weeks at number one. 63 weeks on the... Okay, yeah. Harry Styles is number eight because Christmas songs are flipping taking over now. I mean, it is December. It peaked at number two. It could have been number one, but yeah, no chance of getting a number one anymore. It's going to be... Like six at the year end for 2023. 15 weeks at number one though. Yeah, it's surprising that Harry would be taken down by like blown up songs and then he'd return like a few times at number one. 34 weeks on the charts. Number one. I think I know what this might be. It might be 
It's gonna be heat waves, I think. Yeah, I don't know yet. Yeah, it's gonna be heat waves, hundred percent. I watch prediction videos. People would predict heat waves, and yeah, you know, heat waves, hundred percent number one. Five weeks, ninety-one weeks on the chart. Sixteen in twenty twenty-one. Okay. Well, number one. Okay, this is gonna be hard now. This is gonna be hard now. This is gonna be hard now. Let me move my face cam real quick. Um, heat waves as it was. Stay. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine songs to choose from. Okay, we're gonna rank these nine songs from here, and then so it's gonna be as it was for number one. Stay will be number two. Heat waves will be number three. Shivers will be four. First class will be five. Easy on me will be last. I'm sorry. Big energy will be six, I think. Yeah, six, seven, eight, and then easy on me will be ninth. Okay. <laughs> Not to be harsh on Adele, though. All right, we're going to rank the top ten songs of this year. All right, um, and then we'll look at some comments, see if we're accurate. So number one has to be Sunroof. My favorite song right now. Come on now. Number two, Numb Little Bug. Definitely a hit for sure. Uh, what well, would be number three as it was? Yeah, as it was number three. Legit getting milked on the radio still. But, um, yeah. And Harry would find ways to get back on the list. Alright, uh, how about top five since it's 17 minutes long, I guess? What can I say? About damn time has to be number four. What should be number five? Uh, maybe, maybe bad habit. Maybe bad habit. I don't know. So, yeah. Sunroof. Uh, no little bug, what else? As it was, about damn time, and bad habit. My top five. Uh, let's see the comments, see what their top five is. Top ten. They're, they have top ten. Running up that hill. Yeah. About damn time at four. Smoking out the window. Easy on me. That's okay. Okay. Honorable ben mentions. Yeah, as it was here, cold heart. Wait for you, numb little bug. I hate you. Glimpse of us, sand in my boots, rocking a hard and yeah, everything. What else? Yeah, antihero is gonna be number one. I'm calling it. Antihero will be number one on the Billboard Hot Year End for 2023. No cap. I'm predicting this. This is Dua Lipa's thing, you know, appearances in the Billboard. Yeah, I can't click, unfortunately. Best hit songs of 2022, Hot 100 vs. Global 200. Yeah, we're making a long video right here. And we're taking so long. <laughs> oh my god, hurry up now. Unholy, yeah. I 100% agree with Unholy being the best song for that. But yeah, that's what I just said. <laughs> that's what I just said. Uh, Dandelions? Oh yeah, some of these he listed... They were not on the Hot 100. Yeah, Snap, too. Uh-huh. What else? My opinion, 190. Oh, my God. Get this face, Let's get this face cam out of here real quick. Uh, what else? Yeah, we are 100% lag. Yeah. There are more comments, but uh, we'll look at these. Oh. Loading button. This has been a long video, and I'm sorry. Because, you know, I kind of give my opinions out. Wow. Unholy as a dishonorable mention. I disagree. I disagree, bro. I 100% disagree with you. Take my name, yeah. That would be a dishonorable mention for me before. Fingers crossed is a worst. Damn. Oh, my God. Dishon now, I don't agree with you. Oh, yeah. Come on now. We shouldn't have Christmas songs no more. No, no dishonorable, but mention. Okay, okay. Fancy, yeah, that's definitely the worst. Till you camp for thirty four, twenty four, numb little bug as a honorable mention. New proof, worst one right now. Okay. Yeah, running up the hill. Stranger Things really took off, and it'll take off again in twenty twenty four when there's a new season. Enemy was the worst. Yeah, sometimes I'd get annoyed sometimes. Oh, there are more comments. All right, um. Alright, thoughts and ratings for most good songs. A tier for, um, as it, heat waves as it was, stay, easy on me, shivers, first class B, A for big energy, 
B for Ghost, D for Super Gremlin, Cold Heart gets a B, About Damn Time was an A, hopefully that'd be, yeah. Bad Habits is an A. Boyfriend, and that's what I want. 14 and 51, okay. Industry Baby, same as Bad Habits, that's an A. Wasted on You being a C. Uh, I, I'd give that a B, not gonna lie. S tier, wow. Ah, Bad Habit, yeah, I definitely agree. C, best, yeah. Yeah, that's gonna be number five. Bad Habit's gonna be a top three in the 2023 year end. B, S, yeah, Numb Little Bug has to be top ten for thing. If if it's not top ten, then Billboard's disrespecting him by hold right there, so yeah. Did they really? <laughs> okay, and no, uh, yeah. E, how, yeah. Yeah, I don't really. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, this was pretty much a mediocre year, kind of. Bad habit, yeah, yeah, all of this stuff, yeah. And so, yeah. Alright, we're just looking. Unholy made it to the year-end list with six weeks. Damn. Why should we not have Antihero? If we gave one more week, Antihero would have made it, kind of, I guess. Yeah, as it was, could have taken number um, number one. Yeah, I could agree. Nah, Ghost is not number one. Come on now. Uh, Harry Styles gets a number one. But it, that's your opinion, alright? Yeah. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Billboard should have implemented a 53rd week this year. They could have got bo- gotten both Antihero and Son of a sin- Sinner and potentially even Unstoppable in. Would have been a lot more satisfying than seeing circles of, around this town in one Mississippi, two songs that aren't bad but don't deserve to be anywhere near this list. Yeah, I hundred percent agree. Speaking of bad, this is just the worst. This is the worst top ah top ten list for a year since twenty sixteen. It's boring, uninspired, and a leftover from twenty twenty. Yeah, twenty twenty one's year end being the number one being number one is the tip of it. Also for yeah. Oh. Top 10, but yeah. Uh, where is as it was? Fight me? <laughs> I'm not gonna fight you. Come on now. Uh, top 10 worst. Uh, yeah. Maybe. Such a mid year. Yeah, it was mediocre. This year was mediocre. It would have been better if as it was and it was number one, though. Come on now. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Longest charting Hot 100 song of all time, smashing, surprising blinding lights by a week. Damn. Oh my god, if Heat Waves. Yeah, Heat Waves should. Dang, though. If Heat Waves did not exist, the top two would have been the top two I've ever seen in my li- entire life for the charts. Damn you, Heat Waves. <laughs> what the heck? My personal year end top 10. Numb little bug, out of time, don't you worry. One night now, sacrifice, bam bam. I'm good. When I'm gone, save your tears in better days. I'm not going to add to my top 10. But, uh. I'm going to put my top 10 in the community post, by the way. By the way, this is so... Best hits 2022. In my opinion, I didn't count, th- count Ruth for obvious reasons. I think he means Ruth B, maybe. Okay. Uh, is okay so yeah that was yeah all right so that's gonna be the video um oh he always becomes the first carry over the top of your end list oh. 15 carryovers damn Bad Bunny and Doja Cat are tied for having the most songs out of any artist on the list with seven. Seven. Seven each. Elton John en- earns his first year end entry after two decades with his Dua Lipa collab Cold Heart. Okay. Yeah. Oldest song to make the list. Yeah, running up that hill. And Kanto soundtrack. Yeah, that was pretty decent soundtrack. I mean. We don't talk about the Br- Bruno was it? Three in a row. Some well-known artists who made the year end for the first time, such as our Glass Animals, Lotto, J.I.D., Kate Bush, Steve Lacey, and Byhold 
um, Cody Johnson, Jordan Davis, Dove Cameron, Joji, Muni Long, Carol G, Willow as one half of the anxiety. Um, Russell Dickerson, <laughs> um, Scotty McCreary, John Party, and Kim Petras. Okay. Yeah, these are pretty good facts, not gonna lie. Though, that was a pretty, these are pretty, this is definitely the comment I'm gonna 100% like. Yeah, get this in the most like comment, why not? This has been a 26 minute long video, and I'm sorry for that. Why the fuck? Or there's. <laughs> yeah, let me just look. We don't talk, okay. Personally, I'm impressed that Unholy made it to 98 in such a short amount of time. When was the last time something like that happened? Maybe Hello by Adele did that. Hello mid the year, yeah, and in 2015 with just three weeks of tracking. If they counted another week, Antihero would have made it with, yeah, come on now. Alright, so, yeah, and yeah, um, good is definitely a bop, alright, so yeah. So definitely, uh, yeah, why is there no Antihero? <laughs> Give it one more week. The top five are non-American artists. Wow, I did not notice that. Except for which... Except for which Charlton slash the Kid Leroy is Australian while Justin Bieber is Canadian. All of those artists are British. Damn. It's insane, bro. We got five of them in here. Who are the top five? Uh, shoot, I forgot. Oh my god, I need to move my face cam. Dude, this has been a long video. Yeah, who is... Oh yeah, Ed Sheeran, British, Kid Leroy... Oh, no, 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 wait, hold up. What was number four? I forgot what was number four was. Oh yeah, Adele is British as well. Kid Leroy and Justin Bieber. Kid Leroy is um, Australian. Justin Bieber is Canadian. Harry Styles is British as well. Last Animal is also British. Dang. So yeah, this has been a long video and I'm sorry. Anyways, thank you all for watching. This has been a really good video to make. Um, so yeah. And if this blows up, tell me what um Hot 100 songs should appear. Tell me what songs should appear in the 2023 um Hot 1 uh, year end. Well, it should be the top 10, you know? Uh, anyways, I'll see you in the next one.